Hi, I'm Patricia and we're here at London Fashion Week. Many may say that these trends aren't actually found on the catwalk, but actually out here on the streets. So today we're going to have a look at some of the street style from many people who are here today, from the wacky to the chic. So is this your usual style? Yeah, I don't usually dress particularly colourfully. I like to dress in kind of blacks and whites and the odd pop of colour or silver. So where do you draw your inspiration from? Uh, mostly other blogs. So what inspires your look? Um, definitely Japanese street style and also historical fashion, like if you think what Marie Antoinette wore. Today I'm wearing a Kenzo Paris jumper um, along with some misguided faux leather joggers. Um, a misguided clear clutch and some perspex heels with a cool perspex wedge. Street style inspires my style, so it's mainly the people that I see on the street and so like places coming like, you know, London Fashion Week, you can kind of grasp kind of different trends and things like that. So you're looking lovely and very like in white, so what's your inspiration of today's look? Maybe the catwalk from last year, I really liked the Topshop Unique show and I wanted to kind of collaborate that in like today's look. So do you ever take style um, inspiration from street style or anything like that? Yeah, I've got my own fashion blog, so I read quite a few of them. And yeah, that's where I get my main inspiration from, street style. You look amazing today. What's inspired your look? Definitely the weather. It's been <laughs> freezing lately, so I put on uh, the fur. And uh, the pyjama suit, I love it. It's so comfy, but it has a, a really nice vibe. <laughs> do you want to talk through your look? My look, um, I tend to keep things quite classic but with a twist. I love the Italian and French and European fashion more than the British. Um, but I tend to keep things quite simple, black and white, and then add like hints of something, a little bit of gold, a little bit of brown. Keep it quite simple and classic. Did your makeup inspire your look in any way? I've always loved makeup, always, 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 ever since the Playboy Chab days at 13, sadly. But I try not to go too overboard with it. I try and dress it down with the clothing. So what's inspired your look today? Um, well, I made the toosie at home from some vintage fabric. Um, I've got my little raincoat because obviously it is pouring down. <laughs> and I don't know, I just like put together whatever, really. So what do you think of the street style that you've seen so far here? I think it's just like mad, like everyone is so different, but I think it's like so acceptable to be different. Like no one really looks at you weirdly, like no one really cares. So you look lovely today. What's inspired your look? Um, I had about seven minutes to get ready and my shower was broken. <laughs> so the hat is to cover a manner of sins. Um, the coat is to keep me warm. It's a bit mad. But the good thing is that because it's shedding, everyone can trace me wherever I've gone. <laughs> um, and the shoes, everything is just sort of comfortable. I think you have to be comfortable at Fashion Week, especially on the cobblestones, because no one needs to see your ass. That's very true. No one needs it. <laughs> So what do you think of street style then? Oh, street style here is insane. Like, this is what I come to see. I don't come to see the shows as much as I come to see what the people who watch the shows are wearing because I think that's where the true taste and class comes in. So that's all from London Fashion Week. If you have any thoughts, leave them in the comments below and make sure you subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. Yeah.